Hello! I am going to be doing a review and a demonstration with the Sunjo. Oops, what is it again? It is a Sunjo um, electric uh, power washer for sidewalks and cars and home exteriors. And today I am washing our very dirty sidewalks. And I'm going to show you here. These are what they look like after 10 years, 10 years of rain coming off of the tile, the uh, shingles on the house and some of the dirt and just washing over these sidewalks. You see how filthy they are, how dirty they are. And so I'm going to be doing, I'm, I've already done some here, I'm going to show you. This is a very powerful little tool and uh, I think well, worth the money. So we started out with it as dirty as this. You see? You see this, right? Very dirty. Okay? And I applied some of the soap with the special nozzle, which I'll show you in a moment. And, um, and then I proceeded to use one of the other attachments for the nozzle for a very concentrated spray uh, range. Very, very concentrated. And I want you to see the difference it made. So it started out looking like, uh, like this. Watch. Look how dirty that is. Like absolutely filthy. And now look at the difference. Isn't that amazing? That is simply freaking amazing. Yeah, what a difference. It's like new again, brand new. So this is a very, um, all of the, now, okay, now, this is unscripted, you see, <laughs> live. Um, okay, so there are two containers there were two containers with this little guy and I filled this one with water and some dishwash, uh, uh, dish, uh, dish soap, palm olive, just some basic dish soap. I prefer to pick one that has no ammonia in it. I, I'm using the original formula of palm olive, so this could be a little plug for palm olive. Um, and, um, but no ammonia because it's going to run off in the street and also in the grass and so I don't want it to kill the grass and um, I don't want it to be harmful. So anyways, here we go. So we have the on off switch here. I've plugged it in with my, my large hose. Um, it has, take a look, it has four caps. One of them is, go away, go away bug. Want to see the yellow one here? It's got a very fine, very fine spray it says 15 percent that's the angle of the spray there are four of them there's one for soap black one and that's the one i put on first to apply the soap a little bit of soap it really helps to emulsify um, and cut through the dirt cut through the dirt and then there's a one with a 40 degree angle which is pretty wide take a look 40 degree Put this one back. They just snap into place here. This one has a 25 degree angle. Okay. Snap it back into place. And one has a zero degree, so it's very fine. But I'm finding actually that the, the one that I'm using is only a 15 degree angle and it is sufficient. Now there's a little bit of a trick to doing this. There's a little bit of a trick to doing this. So what's really important, I find, is that you're not spraying it at a distance like this. This is what I was doing at first. And it barely cut into that. If you want to maximize the use of this tool, what you want to do is you want to get up close, literally within, within inches of the cement, so that you're going to waste a lot less water 
in the process of cleaning and you're going to maximize the cleaning effect of I've got to get rid of these mosquitoes they are not my friends so here we go let's do a little demo here okay so I put on the 15 the 15 degree nozzle and take a look at how effective it is so you're minimizing water waste and you're maximizing the effect of the sprayer for cleaning so you're basically doing one pass one pass is all it takes before that I was too far and take a look here at the difference What you want to do is you want to move up very close to maximize the pressure and it cuts right into the right into the little groove. So this has been Alana from Alana Solutions. Hope you enjoyed this demo of the Sunjo power washer. And um, be sure to subscribe, leave me a review. I'd love to respond to you. Hope this helps you. And have a great day. Come back again.